Hey guys, T-Rex back again, and here with another episode of Jurassic World, the game, and I've got the volume up far too loud, so I'm going to turn that down a little, and yep, we're back in, it's perfectly fine. Anyway, so as you can see, um, there's some more events to go in battle, there's a battle build up, there's a monsters of the deep, and a Sora, Serato, Serato, I need to say this guy's name right. I keep doing it wrong, but Ceratosaurus Tournament, and also, nope, okay, so these three, these three are what we want to do. First of all, we're going to start off with the Ceratosaurus Tournament, just because we want to move up to Dominator, quick and easy as possible. Uh, what team should we use? Microsaurus, Ankylodocus, Ankylodocus, and Spinoraptor. Why not, and use our five bucks to get into this battle. Um... The event seems to have been getting a little harder. I don't know why. But just randomly, uh, last night, Friday night, and Saturday morning, I just woke up and I was like really far back and I was just like, okay, this is weird. I'm assuming they've made it um, a bit more... They've made the bots battle a bit more towards the end, so we don't last as long. I don't know, I'm assuming that's how they've done it. Interesting, but it's not that big of a deal. Um, let's save... We want to swap out with Spinoraptor. That's probably the best thing to do. He's got two, you won't be able to kill us with two. Hits us with one, so that means he's probably got one block. He may not, but he probably has. So let's swap out. Oh, these so these tournaments, they seem super easy lately. I don't know, I think it's just because I've got better dinosaurs now. Uh, so three attack and two blocks. I uh, mean, two saves. And what well, was unnecessary, but we've done it. Not bad, not bad at all. Okay, so yeah, what was I talking about? The tournaments. Seem easier, I'm assuming it's because I've got better dinosaurs, obviously I've been leveling up slowly getting better dinosaurs. And it's just uh, slowly gotten easier for me. Because of that, but uh, like, because um, it's aimed at end game players to get the best dinosaurs. Uh, well, the tournament dinosaurs. It's aimed so when you get further in the game, like me, so currently, where am I? Um, I'm 65, the highest level you could be. I'm starting to get some of the better dinosaurs, I've got all the hybrids. They, um, that's when you're supposed to win these tournaments, but also if you've got enough time to play it because you need time, 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 time to play this. You need to do it at least three times a day, I'd say the battling. I don't know how many you attacked us with, so we're going to do this. And Conoraptor probably won't take out Microphosaurus, so we should be fine. But yeah, you need a lot of time. You need a battle, let's say, when you wake up, midday, midday and close, uh, sub maybe in the afternoon or maybe when you go to sleep, maybe if you can battle twice if you stay up a bit longer, sometimes all-nighters, not all-nighters, what am I about, just staying up late to the mornings, I mean, a lot of you are school kids so you probably can't do that, I'm a uni kid so um, I don't go to uni every day because I don't need to, so yeah, it helps, And but, um, but obviously I need my sleep too, but it's not that bad and there you go, we should be in Dominator now, let's hope we are, are we in Dominator, nope, we're still in Predator, which is a surprise actually. Uh, we might as well do another one and make sure we get into Dominator. Okay, what would I rather have? I'd rather have a mystery pack. But 150 DNA is not the worst thing that could happen. Okay, um, we've used quite a few good ones. So let's, ooh, let's use Ferrazino's. Wait, should I use Ferrazino? No, let's use Tyranodon, Ifigus Digger, and Trudon. Or Trodon? Trodon? Is that how people want to say it? Trodon? I don't like saying it like that. Um, I like saying Trudon. I'm assuming it's not right, like uh, Quellacanth, which is Celiocanth. I don't know why they say it. I don't know why it's said like that. It's weird. But whatever. <laughs> if that's how you say it, you say it like that. I mean, um, fair enough. I mean, I can't control how all the things are said, but obviously, I prefer saying them a different way, even though it's not right. And I don't. Uh, it doesn't have to be right, really, does it, guys? No, nope, not at all. Anyway, anyway, who can take us out with free? Uh, can. Trudon or Trodon. Take him out of two. Probably not, so we're gonna just save up. Play safe, might as well. It's the best way to do it. Always be safe. It's better safe than sorry. But not too safe when you let him save up to like ten. <laughs> uh he's not gonna attack, so he's got two, so he could have two blo blocks. Let's see how many it takes to kill him. If it takes two, no he doesn't. Three, one, two. Okay, we have to do five, but it's probably not a bad idea because Berzian Source is a health tank. And something we want to watch out for. Okay, so now Coolosaurus is probably going to take us out because type advantage. That's not too bad, that's not too bad. Because then we'll just swap out for if you go Stegger. 
No, we won't. We won't swap out for him because he'll already be out. We'll swap out for... Wait, will we need to swap out? He's got one block. Can we kill him with two? Yes. Okay, so we do one, two, three. And then uh, it should be easy. One, two, three. Is it goodbye, Mr. Kulosaurus? No. Obviously, I did the dumbest thing ever and... For, for, wait, what? Did he... Okay, well, whatever, whatever. It's not that big of a deal. He's going to swap out for a Spino Raptor. He's going to use three, so he's used all of them. If he gets Stega, we'll take Spino Raptor out with two. That means we've got two blocks. If he gets Stega, can survive two two attacks from Colosaurus. And then it shouldn't be too bad after that. Shouldn't be too bad, I hope. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He can't take us out with two. So we'll just see what he does. Hopefully he attacks with two. That'll be the best um, thing he could do. He didn't. But we're going to attack with four, and he wouldn't block blocked before. He wouldn't have blocked before. There you go. Yes, there we go. Goodbye, Mr. Coolosaurus. And now we're in Dominate. We have to be. Right? I mean, it... <coughs> oh, sorry about that, guys. I mean, it makes sense for us to be into Dominate right now. And yep, there you go, Dominator. And the next highest one is 2389. But then watch this. If this doesn't happen, it's going to make me look stupid. But let's just see. 100 bucks, that's good. I need to save up bucks because I need to get Ceratosaurus as soon as possible. Okay, so uh, what what did I say? It was 2 3 something? It's 2 4 16 now. That's ridiculous. The game's just cheating us out of it. Anyway, Diplotator. Diplotator. Who can take him out? Um, any pterosaur, really. So we'll just use Quetzalcoatlus and Tyranodon. Why not? You should use some easy ones. It's not that big of a deal. Okay, so Diplotator level 40, it's cool to actually... Uh, what am I on about? It's cool to actually see him. Level 40, because I probably won't get one anytime soon, because it's not worth it. Well, no, no, it's definitely not worth it. I'd rather spend my bucks on something a bit more useful. Uh, let's just keep saving. I mean, he's going to keep blocking, probably. Ooh, Diplotator, when he opened his mouth there, I like that. I like the model, but he looks so small right now, we can barely see him. I guess it's the curse of the amphibians, they're all pretty small. But anyway, his Quetzalcoatlus and is taken out. Diplotato with ease, and probably didn't need Tyranid on level 20, but we're never gonna use him, so why not be saved and sorry? Why not, guys? Why not? At all? Ooh! And there you go. Not bad. Um, I wonder what the next battle is. Um, it'd be cool to see uh, all the. I was gonna say all the new dinosaurs. How many? It's four battles. Okay, so it's four. So we probably want two alright uh, herbivores, so let's go Shonosaurus. Actually, we don't need them two, do we? Yeah, we do actually. So, Antarctica and Shinosaurus. Only because Shinosaurus has more attack, so we might as well use him to attack and Antarctica to do. Um, tank, I guess. Tank. I probably. It's probably not a good idea to use, use all these guys right now. But, um, it's better to be safe than sorry, I guess. <laughs> I've said that far too many times, haven't I, guess? Yep. Okay, so Tropicopterus is better than Sucaripterus. So, um, it'll be weird to see Sucaripterus next, maybe? Don't think we will, but we are seeing a few hybrids, which is pretty cool. I like that. Maybe we'll get new hybrids. Imagine that. Kind of. I think we need an update soon. We definitely need something to bring us in again. I mean, we haven't got all the aquatics yet, but obviously it's just Super Res and Chronosaurus, and they've been waiting and waiting time. I mean, they've been adding time on, but not doing anything. They keep giving us aquatics we've already got, and I don't get why they would do that before they even give out the rest of them. But it's not that big of a deal, but it's kind of annoying at the same time. Okay, so this is stupid. Let's just use Tyrannosaurus and... Uh, was it... Who's it? Is it... Uh... What's his name? I can't remember his name. I think it's, um... Megalosaurus, that's it. Megalosaurus! But yeah, um... Maybe... I, I, I really want to see some common and rare aquatics. I think that'll be interesting to see. Some less interesting aquatics, but like... Um, still interesting in their own right. It would just be cool to see them. I don't know. I'm, I'm assuming they won't do it because they've only given us super rare and legendaries and given us res and commons. Which seem a tiny bit pointless, but I really wanted to see more variety because, yeah, we only use late game dinosaurs nowadays, but it's good to use them all. Okay, so yeah, as I thought, it's going to be this. So we're going to use Demorphodon. We're going to use there is the Asaurus and Dimetrodon, and um, this should be completely easy. We'll get our legendary pack. It's good to get a legendary pack. Hopefully, we'll get some bucks out of that. Okay, so we've got um, we've got a ridiculous type of advantage against all of these. We're not even that weak. 
except for Ankylodocus who has a ridiculous amount of damage. <laughs> okay, so we're going to have to swap out for Demetrodon. It's the early chance of winning. I mean, early chance of being safe enough to win. Okay, so actually I didn't realise how bad this was going to be. He's obviously- wait, what? He swapped in for Tropicopterus. Okay, so he's got one block. One, two, three. Is that enough? No, four, five. Oh, okay, well, five is fine. He didn't do the one block, so he's got four next go, I think. But um, it's Ankylodocus, so it probably isn't that big of a deal unless he swaps out four. Diplodator. So he's got four. Yep, what's he going to do? He's going to attack with three, which actually kills us. Crikey, that's not good. <laughs> okay, so what's the plan? Let's save four. Why not? I don't see why not. He can't take us out. Well, he can take us out with four. Oh, I just realised how much health he's got. I mean, damage. Okay, so let's do a much to kill him. Okay, so that's definitely killed him. Let's do eight. Let's do eight. We've got to do eight. And yes, I think that's enough. I think six was enough. Come on, Verizinosaurus. Use your claws. And yes, swipe, swipe, swipe his claws. And uh, uh, what's his name? Eclodocus is dead. Anyway, it's Diplodator. It's got six. He can... Probably take us out with six, but I don't think he can take us out with four. Okay, he can. So he's got two blocks. But we've got Demorphodon. And what's Snappy good at? It's snapping his beak and claws and... And Diplodon is down because his weekend is a rare. That wasn't too bad, guys. That wasn't too bad. I'm happy. That was not That was nowhere near our best team. We could use Stegoceratops and Dominus and Coolosaurus, but we don't want to waste bucks. What do we want? I kind of want an Ostrophrocosaurus or a... Shinosaurus or something to get a uh, level 40 that I haven't had already. I mean, T-Rex would be good because we haven't got a level 40 T-Rex and a couple others like Sakasukas, but I want one we haven't had level 40 yet. And it's, um, it's, what's his name? Uh, Sakasu no, not Sakasukas. What's his name? Oh, how can I forget it? Sukoriptorus. Sukomimus. That's it. Sukomimus. We've got 500 bucks. That's good to see. Some coins and Sukumimus, which is good actually, that's really good to get. Because we uh, have a weak one and it'd be good to get a good one. Okay, so who's good against Surface Reef? Okay, so it's probably best to use our cr bad ones at the moment. Um, Would this be a good idea? Let's do this, let's do this. I don't think this is a great idea, but as long as we can save enough, I think Lepticlidus may be able to take out six for us. So, he has got type advantage against all these guys. If he's dumb, he'll use two attacks, and he will put he didn't even use any attacks, so that's actually good. Let's just save as much as possible. Why do you block? Why do you block? That was no point in blocking. No point in blocking, Mr. Stixosaurus. Okay, so he's letting us save. If he lets us save all the way to eight, we might as well use eight. Actually, no, it's really not worth using eight. Let's see what he does. Let's see what he does with four. Okay. Let's use four and set block four. I mean, save four. Because, um, might as well get some damage off. Okay, yeah, there you go. That's only going to be like 300 damage. Yeah, there you go. But that's better than nothing right now. We've got to get as much damage off, off as possible. Five, so he's probably got three blocks. That's weird. Why would he do that? He's probably got three blocks. Okay, so let's just do four. One, two, three, four. In case he doesn't have blocks. You did? Okay, that's fine. That's fine, that's whatever. We've still got four. Let's see what he does. Okay, so he has five. Uh, so he's probably... Oh, well, he's got four. What's he going to do? He didn't do anything. So let's do four again and four saves. Take out as much damage as possible. I don't know how strong Leptogladys actually is. Blocked with four. What? That's weird. That's weird. Why is he doing this? These aquatic guys, these act so weird. Battling other aquatics are so... <laughs> as I said, it's so weird. It, they just do the most weirdest things. Like, look, he's safe three, but why would he do that? I mean, why wouldn't he say four? He's not gonna die for me. Okay, so he's got seven. What's he gonna do? Attack five, so he's got two blocks. Can we take him out with two blocks? Come on, Leptoclitus, give me some good damage. Two blocks. I think we could do this. Yeah, we can do this. We can definitely do this. Come on, use eight. There you go, Leptoclitus. Even though he's not very good, and he was our first super error and our only super error so far, I think. He did a good job. Good Leptoclides. Good little Leptoclides. You little cutie. Anyway, yeah, there you go. He started. Victory. I'm happy with that. 
Why did they show that like weird pose? I mean, it's a nice pose, but it's such a weird thing to stop on. Hmm, Megalodon and Styxosaurus. <sighs> Who's good against... Okay, so there's no point using Cave. Let's use these two. Why not? Our other team is going to be good for our last battle, because they'll probably have Chronosaurus. I usually see Chronosaurus in every battle. That's weird, but it's fine. Okay, let's just save with Styxosaurus and probably take out them two with Megalodon. Well, we hope anyway. Let's see what he does. Anyway, Mr. Megalodon has done two blocks, so he's only got two. What's he gonna do? Okay, let's think. How many can we take him out with? Probably six. Probably six. Five, maybe. Oh no, he's only got 1,000 health. Yeah, we can take him out with like three. Okay, so let's do six and two blocks. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, five and three saves. I don't know why I say blocks. I keep saying blocks when I mean saves or reserves. I'm not going to say reserve because that's a stupid word. I mean, it's not stupid. Obviously, it's what it's called, but I call them saves because saving. You're saving them for their next turn. But then I guess you can say reserving them for next turn, but really it's the same difference. Ooh, he's only two levels higher, but he's it's got like an extra 100 health. Let's see what seven can do. Can we take him out? Nope, we can't. That's kind of bad, but actually it's not too bad. Come on, use your 7 attack. What is it again? Oh yeah, he slams into the ground, doesn't he? Uh, shockwave through the ground, probably kill himself doing that. And there you go, not that much damage done. <laughs> Ooh, can we do this, guys? Can we do this? I think we can. I'm pretty sure we can, but let's see what he's going to do, too. Okay, he's only on two. How many does that leave? He means... Oh yeah, we can do it four. We can do it four. And there you go. Two damage is going to do about... Seven, well, I was going to say more than 14,000, but 17 damage is good. I mean, it's 1,700. And victory for Megalodon. Nicely done. Anyway, what's next? What's next? Okay, as I thought, as I thought, it's Styxosaurus, Chronosaurus, and Chronosaurus. <laughs> I knew it was going to be these two horrible guys. He's got the most damage. Dunk losses. Okay, so we'll do it this way. Ooh. Ammonite is actually really weak. I don't like how bad he is. I mean, he's not that great for a... I mean, why is it surface have all the best dinosaurs? I mean, aquatics. And then the others just got like normal looking... Normal, well, not normal looking, I mean normal ranked. I don't know, it's weird. Anyway, let's stick, swap out for Ammonite. Ammonite is... Well, Ammonite's beautiful. Look at him, level 40. He's just so weak. It's a horrific... Like, saddening... Will he attack? I don't think he'll attack. I don't see why he wants to attack. How many blocks would he have though? He's got two, I think. Can we take him out even though he's got two? Nope. So let's save. He had one block. We could have probably taken him out, but it wasn't worth it. He's got four. What's he going to do? He's going to swap, of course. Chronosaurus can take us out with four. Will he bother though? Probably not, because it wouldn't be a smart idea. Anyway, let's get out Ammonite. Ammonite can kill him with two, so let's do five. Ah, two saves. Yes! There you go. Goodbye, Mr. Chronosaurus! You little majestic dragon, sea dragon. And here is Texasaurus, and you'll probably take out Ammonite. I, li I love Ammonite. He's got such nice, unique animations. They all have unique animations, but I think they, most of them do. I don't know, like, Chronosaurus may have the similar to Mosasaurus. I don't remember. 100%. Well, we don't have Chronosaurus yet, so obviously it's hard to tell. Let's do that many and one save. And there you go, you can buy a stick to the source, and we're going to easily win this. I don't see how we can't win this. Oh, the problem with Chronosaurus. Same with the problem with Cave Aquatics. Let's say we compare to everything else. I mean, Surface. Why? Why is Surface all round and the others aren't? I don't see... I just don't see why. It's, it doesn't make much sense to me. Does it make sense to you guys? Tell me in the comments. But anyway. Hmm, this Chronosaurus, he looks a bit um, plainer than I remember him. I swear he looks a bit more colourful at level 40. But whatever, it's fine, it's fine, it's not that big of a deal. It'll be awesome to get him though, I can't wait to see him. I really want Prognathodon, I can't even remember who else there are, in the, who else there is in the game. I don't remember. We'll have to check after this battle, after we get our super rare back and victory. That was pretty easy actually. Um, This is good actually, we won every single battle, compared to like a couple of episodes ago where everyone got annoyed when I got Ammonite because I kept losing. And I know it was bad, it was stupid, but it's not that big of a deal. But there you go. We've got a lot of bucks, we've got a lot of bucks, what about... Okay, so we're still fine, we don't need to battle anymore. 
There's no point boosting or well, speeding up for the rare pack. Um, who's the guys we don't have yet? Okay, so it's four still. It's Dacosaurus. Okay, I technically I've already got one, so that's annoying. That's not that bad, I mean. Prognathlon, I want Festivodermia and Kronosaurus. Festivodermia, Prognath- I want them all. It's weird, guys. I want them all. <laughs> I mean, it's not that weird. Of course I want them all. But I, 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 I just want the more unique ones. Currently, we've got... I mean, they're actually all very unique. I really like how they've done so, uh, many completely different. I really like how they've done that. Got nine Trinolons, never gonna hatch them. <laughs> Trinolons, not that great. I mean, it's good. It's like the all rounded one out of these. Who is it? Demorphodon. Oh, come on, let's swap to our nice looking Demorphodon. Yep, there's Snappy Tyranodon and Snappy Junior. Anyway, I'm gonna end it here because there's really not much else to do. We've done the weekend stuff. Ceratosaurus is probably gonna be over soon. Over, or the next time I record this. Sorry about no video yesterday. I did do Tiny Dino World, but I just didn't think it was good enough and I didn't wanna upload it. I'm gonna end it here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you give this video a thumbs up, make sure you subscribe for more, and I'll see you again with more Jurassic World The Game, where we get some more battles and some more creatures and some more, hopefully, Ceratosaurus. Goodbye, guys!